Hey, what's up guys? It's Turtle Juice here, and today I'm going to do a commentary on two games of my Call of Duty Rampageness, and one of them's with a, I forget what this weapon is called, like, something with a G, but I put like a blue mist camo on it. Right there, I shot at the wall for no certain reason. And I'm running towards the thing now, but um... Yeah, the other game plays with a uh, M16 and a uh, dual, which we call dual revolvers. And these are two short matches that we came out and won. I think both of them. But uh, right here, I don't, I don't get much kills in, during the start. But this, this game is awesome. It's like the awesome, like. It's like the best customization of multiplayer ever. Like you can customize your red dot, you can customize your gear, you can customize your clan tag, and then you can put it on your gun if you want, or you can leave it off your gun. And then you can make an emblem in like Halo 3, but it's way better because it's huge. And uh, then you can put that on your gun if you want, but if it doesn't look right, then. You can take it off and stuff, but it's pretty sweet. You can make cool uh, pictures on there. And I'm spraying right there, and I got three kill streaks. And this is an epic fail. I blow up there, and I want to see if. Yeah, watch this. <laughs> that was the worst fail ever. I I slipped the trigger or whatever. I accidentally pressed. Um, freaking RT instead of LB I thought was the boost I, I'm still getting used to the controls of it but uh yeah right there I just got a nice triple kill and uh double kill right there or two ki uh, one kill and uh I don't know if I get uh, a third kill or I mean a fifth kill for the napalm or what but Dude, but this campaign of this game is amazing. It is like the freakiest, epicest Call of Duty campaign ever. I'm not going to say anything about it because I don't want to ruin it for other people that haven't seen it. But I can tell you that it's amazing. And you definitely, if you don't have this game, this game is the best game out for on the market right now. That's what I'm saying. Because this is awesome customization zombies are like amazing because you have the, I don't want to I don't want to ruin everything but zombies are amazing and um stuff like that like everyone um everyone pretty much has this game already but if you don't I just don't want to ruin it for you because I know it seems funner to find it out on your own so if you watch game plays and all that it's kind of it kind of ruins the game for you if you don't uh, if you don't uh, have it but multiplayer it's like uh, it's amazing like they have it all up like they have wager games which are like games you can bet against the other people and then like if you win you win money if you lose you lose the money that you put into betting there's a high roller which is like you bet like um I don't know it's either high low uh big or pro gambler which is like 10 grand of XP points or credits they this game like Oh my gosh, you don't unlock things and when you uh, shoot, when you kill people with certain guns, you don't unlock things for that certain gun, you unlock credits if you have a good KD, and those credits can buy you anything, they can buy you perks, they can buy you camos, they can buy you, there's tons of camos guys, and there's tons of red dot sites that you could buy, and you can buy colors for your red dot sites, which is cool beans. And, uh, you can customize, uh, customize the, uh, you can have different clothes, which is your first perk, your blue perk or whatever, is like your, uh, clothing that you have. You can be ghost, which is like un 
detected and lightweight, which is uh, makes you run faster than the other things, but not as fast as, uh, well, it's not really that fast, but um, if you have marathon, you can go farther. Uh, lightweight isn't as, uh, like, pumped up as uh, Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2. I think this game, this la uh, this first game is coming to a wrap up and the, uh, the next game will be up close. But I like this camo, it's like a light and it like, it's like spray painted and stuff and um, yeah. But the campaign's awesome and uh, what was I saying about, oh yeah, the um, the multiplayer is totally leveled out I think, I mean like some people might think it's overpowered some guns which they'll probably patch it in no time but um yeah okay this is uh i think i have a do i have a custom scope for my yeah i have a diamond scope for my acog see it has diamond i don't like changing my colors because i think it i think it uh makes you worse if you change your colors to like lighter colors because red dot is like indicates where it is mostly because if it's yellow it kind of sets me off and it makes me shoot all over the place but uh I like red better than uh yellow or blue or whatever but um yeah my thoughts on this game like this game is uh crazy in the multiplayer experience like no other game is uh this deep into multiplayer this in the uh, consoles in in like PC gaming there's different kinds of games but this is like crazy for the uh, different type of game types all the different type of game types they have for the uh, for the multiplayer there's gun game there's there's this thing where if you're not so good at multiplayer like you're not good against the pros, you can go into the combat training with computers and you can send them to lower difficulties or higher difficulties. I think veteran is the highest or hardened is the uh, second highest and recruits the lowest and uh, yeah and that's it. it's crazy because it's like uh, crazy into uh, uh, training and all that stuff with multiplayer you can do so many things if you're like you could probably teach a little kid how to do it like a like a two year old if he just starts off uh, playing on the uh, combat training and then he gets better and better and better and then he gets uh, higher uh, higher r higher ranks in the combat training he will uh, um be better at the game and he'll eventually get smarter I guess maybe maybe he'll be the next Einstein who who knows Call of Duty makes the next Einstein that'd be crazy but combat combat training is very helpful to like new people that don't wanna um, go on multiplayer because it's no fun because you get killed all the time and uh, because there's some people that have been playing Call of Duty all their lives. Like, i am been playing it since Call of Duty 4 because that's when it really came, boomed up. Because Call, Call of Duty 3 was cool, though, but I didn't have, like, a gaming console at that time. But the 360 was, like, out when Call of Duty uh, 4 came out, and everyone was, like, game playing commentary started up on that and then machinima just like went through the roof in the his house for rizzle my nizzle and everyone uh exploded common taters and then modern warfare 2 brought in so many new ones and this game is going to bring in tons and tons of new commentators it's going to be insane but yeah because there's a theater mode where you could uh, edit your videos like record them and then show them to other people so you could share them with uh, other people that have recorders and you could ask them if they could put it on their YouTube channel or uh, uh, they could make another one and send the clip to them 
and then they could commentate on that with their uh, microphone. You could buy a microphone for uh, $10 or something at the uh, store. But yeah, anyways, oh wow, well, someone messaged me on Skype. But anyways, okay, I got killed there. That ticks me off. This is this is the part where I was getting mad at myself because I get, kept getting killed. But yep, <laughs> I get, get spawn killed. The spawns are a little broken. I mean, like you spawn near people a lot. Like I'm not gonna lie. That's the oh my god. That was the biggest fail ever. But um, yeah. A anyway, any other how any other reason it. This is amazing. Okay, I got that guy back. Woo. But uh, I ha I'm i sorry I haven't been talking about the gameplay much. I just... um, the, It's just my thoughts on the uh, game and all that. And you guys might have other thoughts. Just uh, post it in the comments below if it's uh, you think it's a good game overall or you think it's a bad game or like what specific part of the games you don't like and what specific parts you do like and stuff like that okay I got a headshot right there but um I'm almost at the end of the campaign I think I'm on my last mission I'll try to beat it after I'm done with this commentary and I upload it to YouTube but um just leave in the comments what you want me to do or put something on my channel what you guys want me to do on Call of Duty and stuff and uh okay the guys the clip is ending so I gotta go so see you guys later